Hello, and we're continuing Harry Potter. Da -da -da -da. Hi, would you consider a trade? No, you fucking bitch. So, I believe we are going to uh, Professor Lockhart, and we're going to learn a spell. Hope so. Spell challenges are really fun. It's no sarcasm intended or something. Do, 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 do. I believe we have to be here. Am I right or am I right? Oh no. You remember where it is, don't you? I'd better get out of here. Filch might be lurking nearby. Well, well, well. I heard a crash and what do I find? Mr. Harry Potter and a broken, irreplaceable antique bar. Argus Filch, the caretaker, was loathed by every student at Hogwarts. Some thought his cat, Mrs. Norris, spied on students. Honestly, it, it just fell. <sighs> hmm, all right. What was that? I don't know. What are you talking about? I heard a voice. Hearing voices won't get you off. Shut up, Filch. I must have been hearing things. You sure have. Harry, can't I go back? I want to shoot, shoot it. Yes, I want the beans. The beans, beans, beans. Yes, here's the secret area. I knew. Yes. Oh no. You threw it in the hole. And then they're gone. Yeah. Alright, let's talk normal now. Dip doo doo. Nothing here. Nope. That's Professor Dumbledore's office. Yes. Um. All right. Let's open this up. Go in it. Open the chest. Hello, Mora. And let's be done with it. Just some beans again. Always beans, beans. All right. Welcome to defense against the dark arts. My thing makes an introduction unnecessary, but I'll delight you with one anyway. I am Gilderoy Lockhart, Order of Merlin, third class. Honorary member of the Dark Force Defense League, and five-time winner of Witch Weekly's Most Charming Smile Award. Ah, I see you've all bought a complete set of my books. Well done. Today, we shall be learning the Rictus Semper spell. Rictus Semper is very useful when stunning certain pesky creatures such as Cornish Pixies. Who must be first? Harry Potter, will you step down? Of course, Harry has to be first. Okay. It's always in all the games. Harry has to be the first. Clear your mind completely, Harry. Don't even think about it. And concentrate on the symbol in front of you. See the wand? It's going to move its way around the symbol. At the exact point when the wand passes over the arrow, mm. hit the corresponding arrow key. It's just like some this dance game. Has three parts. You must hit all of the arrows correctly in order to progress to the next round. Ready to try? Round one, begin. Yeah. Oh shit. I thought it was going the other way around. No. Very <sighs> It's looping all around. Keep it up. You're almost as good as me. Ding, ding, ding. Well done, Harry. You've advanced to the next round. 
five points to Gryffindor. Round two, begin. Oh no, it's a lot difficult now. A lot more difficult. Dun 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 dun. Yes, this is more difficult. Oh shit. I fucked it up. Dun 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 yeah. Fabulous work, Harry. Yeah, fabulous. I'm, I'm fabulous, bitch. Me, you've now completed the exercise. Fifteen points to Griffin. You've learned Rick to Sempra. You didn't do as well as I did the first time, but then who could? Now, how about a turn in the arrogant practice arena? Yes, the challenge. That's what the most fun part of this game. To, to complete the challenge, you must find the completion star, which will be found at the top of this tower. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, you lose the challenge. Along the way, you will find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. Try and find them all. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Ready to begin? Good luck! Three, two, one, go! Oh shit, it's time. Oh, that was... It's annoying. Again, annoying. Well, actually, you can stun them by casting with Decepra on them. Then you can use Flipendo to push them around. Cool. Well... Down, down. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Or easy peasy Japanesey, depends on where you're from. Oh shit. What happened? Bam, down, down. Ooh, chest. Ooh, collector's card. We'll jump down. Oh shit. Pesty little creature. Hmm. Chocolate frog, I need that. Ooh, what's this? That's a giant orange snail. Avoid touching them or their slime trails. The acid that they secrete will burn you. Harry, trust me, I know. Will stun them. How does he know? Mm. All right. Jump down, nigga. Bump down, down. Just shooting those creatures. Easy, huh? Ooh. Oh, all right. You're next. So we'll do this, this, oh, Harry stop, stop being such a dick. Flip and over here, jump on it, jump, 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 and we have a star, ooh, 
I don't want that. That doesn't work, Harry. Jeez. I was always afraid you you fa you'd fall with it by the snail. This jump is very scarce. I don't even know if that is the right word, but yeah. Oh, beans. Again, beans. Nothing here. Nope. Alright. Ooh, we've met those already. They will try to steal your birdie box beans. Flipendo will push them onto their backs and cause them to drop anything they might have stolen. Alright. So, fuck off. I know this. <laughs> What? what? Ah, oh, this. Oh my God. So I'll guess this is the end of this episode, as we are at the safe book. So, uh, you'll hear from me next episode. So, goodbye. Wow.